accounts on social media about food remain among the most popular. In fact, the hashtag recipe has over 100 billion views on TikTok. So the steak sandwich that you saw, that's been viewed over 12 million times. And it was created by our next guest, Tessa Sinatro, just over a year ago. Started posting her recipes on TikTok after several of her recipes went massively viral. She walked away from her teaching job to become a full-time TikTok chef. TanFan, please welcome Tessa Sinatro to the show. Thank you, thank you so much. Oh my God. So it's been so good and so rewarding. You left a job that you love because I know you love teaching. I did, I love teaching so much. I mean, I was a PE and health teacher, so every single day when I went in, it was a new adventure and we honestly played games all day. So yeah. what's not to love? Have and people always said you were a great cook, like your family members and folks around you? Well, my mom is the blueprint for sure. Okay. I like to say I'm mom taught. Um, uh, hi, mom. Uh, hey, mom. But, <laughs> but um, yeah, I've always, you know, had it in the back pocket. It's been in your back pocket. Yeah, yeah. All right, well, now it's on the on the cutting board, and yeah, I'm ready to try. Right. So this recipe, as I said, is the steak recipe that went viral. You're going to walk us through it. Heck yeah. We're going to start with by cutting off our head of garlic here. We're going to roast up a head of garlic. Okay. So I'm going to chop off this head. How often do you cook? I cook probably once a day. Once a day? Once okay. a day, One meal sure. a day or multiple things at one time? Well, when I'm recipe testing yeah. here, I'm going to have you okay. put this right here. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have you olive oil, salt, pepper yep. it, wrap it up into a beautiful okay. little pouch. I love roasting uh, garlic. Sometimes I just do this on my own and I get a piece of bread and go to heaven. Oh yeah, it comes it out so, so delicious. sweet and uh -huh. delicious. So delicious. Okay, got our pouch. Perfect, all right, we're gonna pop that into our little oven here. Okay. And then I'm gonna pop out, you're gonna get a beautiful head of roasted garlic here. Smells so good. Is there anything better than garlic? My look at gosh. that. That's, oh, my God. oh, look at that. You yeah, put a little piece brown, of thyme. By the way, the beautiful. recipe is going to be on our social media. So you got the roasted with the thyme in there. Yeah, okay. so that's going to be stunning. That's going to go as the base right on the bottom of our bread. So we're okay. just going to set that aside right here. Okay. And then we have our chopped white onions. All right. We're going to go into the pan first with just a little bit of butter. I love you because you love butter. Oh, I love right. butter. Oh, and I should say, More QR butter. code on the screen. That's your recipe. All right, you got your butter. Nice little cast iron skillet there. I oh, cook yeah. on cast iron a lot too. Oh yeah, yeah. love cast iron. Stainless steel cast okay. iron. We're gonna throw these okay. right in the pan. All right. All right, so we're gonna get stirring on those. Okay. Now these onions take like two hours to caramelize oh, really, 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 really nicely. Oh, okay. But we're gonna do the speed up version okay. here. And we're gonna have a beautiful finished product uh -huh. of these onions mm, right here. Those look beautiful. Nice and caramelized. They're gonna okay. be sweet and delicious. You wanna hit that with some salt and pepper. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, stunning. People don't know this about me. I probably cook four times a week. I don't oh, eat out get a after lot. It. I love cooking. Monopolizing it, the onions. It, it, no, 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 you do this. It <laughs> actually relaxes me. But this is next level. Okay, so you have what kind of meat right, is so this? So I'm gonna scooch around That's you here. Okay. And I'm gonna season up our steak. So we have a beautiful New York strip here. Nice cut, nice, nice cut. Nice cut of meat. And we're just gonna season this up. We're gonna get a healthy Hot little pan. sprinkle of okay. olive oil. Keep mixing those onions. Okay. That'd be yes, absolutely boss. perfect. Okay, these are cool. Season this up. I'm gonna do a nice pinch of salt. We're gonna do our seasoning hand and then our meat hand, so yeah. we're not gonna mix it up there. And so what you, this is really just a simple preparation of salt, pepper, olive oil on the steak so far. Oh yeah. Okay. But we really let the ingredients shine. let the meat shine. Exactly, okay. right. took the words right out of my mouth. What temperature of steak do you like? Ooh, I'm a, I'm a medium rare. Me now. too, I'm yeah. a medium rare too. That's, yeah. that's the way you Texas, gotta eat it. Texas, that's right? how we do it. All right, we're gonna do a, a healthy little drizzle yeah. olive oil. Oh, yeah. that's a nice hot pan. That is a nice, cause you get a nice sear on that steak that's to trap exactly the juices right. in. We're gonna get that oil shimmering. All right. And what I'm gonna do first, we have a beautiful fat cap on this steak here. Beautiful. So I'm gonna sear that off first. Mm. Oh yeah. Ooh, there, is there anything better than butter or fat like on a hot dog? I'm just over it. Now I'm really right. hungry. Okay, here now we go. we're ready, here we go. Got a nice sear oh, look on that there. sear on Beautiful. that fat cap. Okay. Mm. We're gonna flip to that first side. We're gonna let this go for a couple minutes. That's the okay. trick, right? You know, you eat red meat. Yeah, you want a beautiful yeah. hard sear on the okay. outside of that steak. That and what's so in your well. sauce here? This is our aplob sauce. This oh. is our black peppercorn sauce mm. that we're gonna put on top of the steak right after we construct our sandwich. Okay. So this is our breasted, beautiful seared steak oh that God. we're gonna take over to our cutting board. Look at that. Stunning. And immediately from our steak, we're yeah. gonna take our chopped shallots. Oh, you got your shallots there. Shallots in here, and we're scraping all the brown bits off the bottom of this pan. This is where all that flavor is from the steak. Whoa. And that's gonna come together so nicely with our sauce. Okay. So we're gonna add in with our sauce our beef broth. Mm. I mean, you're not kidding around here. Let me get a little bit of that going. We're gonna throw in a little bit of our cognac. Oh. 
Ma'am, you too really much, are. Not too much. Just cook that down a little bit. Get it a little saucy. Let's see. And how Turn often do you make this sandwich now that it's gone viral? Well, let's see. My girlfriend asked for it about like once a week. So okay. we're going on once a week right now. <laughs> <laughs> this is a, You're gonna, got a beautiful yeah. medium rare on that. Okay, I'm done. Watch my finger because I need it. There you go. All right. Mm. How we do? Very mm. good. Ah. That's the, I know, right? That, that steak is delicious. All right, we're gonna. So you now on the sandwich, you have your caramelized onions, your meat, your salad, and what is this dressing here? That is the borzon cheese. Oh, borzon cheese. Yeah, oh. right here is our bottom layer. It's mm. like I said, intricate, but it is very, very delicious. Mm. Now I also know that you know that I love grilled cheese sandwiches. I did hear that. It's my, I'm obsessed. I could eat a grilled cheese sandwich every day of my life. Which I don't blame you. And you have what you say is the best grilled cheese ever made. I, I like to think so. Uh, that's when, listen, you can't rescind trash Oh, no, talk. you're right, you're right. Okay, you it's the it. best grilled cheese uh, ever made, 100%. Okay. All right, I'm gonna taste your steak sandwich. Oh. <laughs> Ma'am. We do okay? Ma'am, never go back to teaching. <laughs> this is it, this is it. That cheese, the garlic, I mean, even though you added the sauce in, you still taste the steak. You have, this is real. Thank you so much. This is real. Thank this you so real. much. I'm so glad that you love it. it. Now, you have this grilled cheese now for me to taste. I do. We got the secret sauce in there. The secret sauce, a little garlic aioli that you put on the inside of the bread. You toast the inside and then you put the cheese on those inside toasted pieces. You got double crunch. Okay. <laughs> You've created a problem in my life. Uh -oh. <laughs> because my dear friend Carla Hall, the world-renowned chef, was on this show, has come many times, and I only eat Carla Hall's grilled cheese. Uh-oh, okay. Uh-oh. You have created a problem in my life. <laughs> now, are you gonna call Carla and tell her I'm gonna call her? I think I'm gonna leave that one up to you. I'm gonna leave that one up to you. This is delicious. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I don't know which one I can finish. <laughs> I'm like, stay grilled cheese. Stay. Go up, scan the code for the grilled cheese. I promise you, you will not regret making either one of these sandwiches. You went viral for a reason, because sometimes some of these kids on TikTok don't pay off. <laughs> this is the real deal. Thank you. Thank Tessa, you. Tessa.